Hi there guys, Jodie Vanity here and as you can tell from the uh, beginning of this video I am going to be doing a review! Yay! If you watch my videos you would already know that this is not something I usually do so I thought I'd try something new out for the channel and see where I can take this As you could sort of hear already I have a cold at the moment and um, I also did a post on Facebook yesterday with my face caked in makeup and it has left my face in a really bad way it's like poof there goes the spot fairy you know kinda knew I was planning to do a video today and they decided to go Ooh, spots and trying to destroy my chances of making a good video but you know what you know, everyone gets spots as part of life and growing up, so nothing really I can do about it. So, yeah. I have actually got more items that I'm going to review today. But the problem is, is they're in the wash because um, I did a photo shoot in these. And some of them got a bit dirty, so they've needed to be washed. So they're in the wash and the rest of this will be done another day which means great for everyone else who likes watching my videos and if you don't, tough shit. <gasps> I swore! Oh no! I did a bad. I did a bad. The internet police are gonna get me. Don't get me. Please. I have no idea what the fudge that just was. So ignore that bit. The actual company I will be reviewing is Spree Picky. Okay, so for the review, the first thing I'm going to be reviewing is the wig. Okay, this can be a pain in the ass to put on. Oh, I forgot to put my hair back. Ah, that's alright, I'll just do it like this. Okay, it's quite a nice wig, but the thing is, it gets in your eyes. I don't know how the wig is meant to go, and, you know, I kind of like it like a full fringe, so I usually just leave it like this. Um, you see, I really like this wig. It's It's got um, a cap on the inside, but it takes, like, forever to get on. So, I think I'll leave that for a minute. Um... I really, really love the colour. I don't know if you can see, but it's like a, uh, like a purpley grey. That probably makes no sense, but that's the kind of colour that it is. Um, apart from the fact that it's sort of difficult to put on, it is a really, really nice wig. Um, I'm not a huge fan of wigs anyway because they're really hard to take care of because I don't have one of them head things that you can put your wig on. So I find that they get really matted at the bottom and then you go around looking like you got an afro. So, um, yeah, but other than that, this is a really nice wig. It's, you know, it doesn't really fall out. You know, a lot of the time when I've had wigs before, they sort of, you know, just kind of like fall apart in your hands. But you can brush this pretty well and it don't fall out. So that's always a good sign. Um, the cap on the inside, which I will show you now, um, has a clip so you can make it smaller or bigger towards your head, whatever. You know, I didn't put it on properly, but you can get the point. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to review is the bunny jumper. Yay. Okay, this jumper um, is no good for a day like today because it is really, really hot outside. But it's a really warm fleece, and when I got this, this is something I wore, you know, like every day. For the simple reason, it is so warm and fluffy, and it, it literally is like a fleece material. I don't know if, you know, any of you people from the UK would, would remember what uh, primary school jumpers feel like on the inside. You know, it's also kind of fluffy and warm on the inside, so yeah. That's what this feels like. I love the design. Honestly, I love it. It's like, ah, oh, it's the best. Um, this is meant to be a small, and I'm small, and it's quite big. But if you like big jumpers, I would suggest you go for a small, if you're small. That probably made no sense. But, um, yeah, other than that, really, really nice jumper. 
Okay, so the last thing I'm going to review is this gorgeous dress. Okay, it's got music notes all over it. Um, I actually really love this. When I saw this on the actual site, I was like, I need this dress. Um, I was really disappointed when I received this in the post because the zip's broken. So you can't tighten it up. So it's like, yeah, you just can't tighten it. Um, which is really disappointing. So I can't do a proper review on this because I can't wear it. Um, material wise, it's quite thin and see through. However, it does have an underlayer, as you can see here. So it kind of covers up, you know, if you're wearing underwear and stuff. Well, you should be wearing underwear. But um, it will cover that up so you ain't got no problems with it being really see through. Um, yeah, quite warm material, strangely, for a dress. Um, yeah. Other than that, beautiful dress. Okay, well that wraps things up for today's review video. If you like the video, please subscribe and um, I will put links in the description. If you like the video, please subscribe because I'll be making some more. I will put the links to the items in the description along with the store link. So you should be able to take yourself right there.